Fankvárosi Torna Club is a Hungarian professional sports club based in Fankváros, Budapest, that plays in the Hungarian league. Fankváros was founded in 1899 by Ferenc Springer and a group of local residents of Budapest's 9th district, Fankváros. Fankváros is best known internationally for winning the 1964-65 season of the Intercities Fairs Cup and for reaching the final of the 1974-75 season of the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup. The best known part of the club is the well-supported men's football team a Euro the most popular team in the country. Other divisions include the women's football, women's handball, men's futsal, men's ice hockey, men's handball, men's water polo, cycling, gymnastics, athletics, wrestling, curling and swimming teams, some of which are highly successful. The club colors are green and white, and the club mascot is a green eagle. Hence another of the club's nicknames, the Green Eagles. History, Funkvaros is the most successful Hungarian team on both home and international turf. They won the Intercities Fairs Cup 1964-65 and have won the Hungarian National Championship by 28 times and the Hungarian Cup 20 times. Fankvaros participated in all the first division championships since the start of Hungarian football championships in 1901 until the 2006 July season in which they were relegated to the NB2 for not meeting financial criteria. The team returned to the first Hungarian league after three years in the second division. Since 2011 the club operates under the directions of Garbok Hibitov and Pa'el Eros Jaya who brought financial and operational stability to the club again. Now, in 2014 the club is seeking to get back to the European football elite, first by qualifying into one of the European Cup series. According to the plans, the first qualifiers will be held in the club's freshly finished ultra-modern stadium. 1900s. On May 3, 1899, Fankvarosi TC was founded by citizens of the 9th district of Budapest. Ferenc Springer, a lawyer from the same district, was nominated as the first chairman of the club. The club's budget was raised by a ball held in order to celebrate the establishment of the club. The club's first pitch was built on Sregsori Avenue in the 9th district. On December 3, 1900, the football department of Fankvaros was officially founded. Two months later, in February, the first match of the Hungarian league was played between Funkvaros and Budapesti Torna Club. Since the match was not announced to the Hungarian Football Federation, it is not considered as the club's first official match. On April 21, 1900, the team played their first official match against Ma Plus or Minus Egidum and Funkvaros lost their first match 5 Euro 3. The first goal for the club was scored by Gaspar Borba S. The first point in the championship was gained against Ma plus or minus Egutum with a draw. The first victory came on June 16, 1901, when Funkvaros beat Budapesti Sport Club 5 a Euro 1. In 1902 Funkvaros suffered the heaviest defeat in their history when they were beaten by 16-0 by Oxford United FC. Funkvaros played their first match in an international competition against Budapesti Torna Club in the 1901-02 Challenge Cup on April 27, 1902. Funkvaros lost to 5-1 against their home rival in the Hungarian final of the Challenge Cup. Funkvaros entered the 1902-03 Challenge Cup and won the Hungarian final against 33 FC by 1-0. In the semi-finals Fankvaros played their first official international match against Wiener Athletic Sport Club and lost to 5-1 on May 3, 1903. The 1903 season of the Hungarian League was won by Fankvaros. Two years later in 1905, Fankvaros became Hungarian champions for the second time. The 1906 July season was won by Fankvaros. Fankvaros participated in the 1908-09 Challenge Cup. On April 10, 1909, Funkvaros beat VfB Leipzig 4-1. On April 11, 1909, Funkvaros drew with Budapesti Torna Club and on April 12, 1909 Funkvaros beat MTK Budapest FC 2-1. As a consequence, Funkvaros finished first in the main tournament and qualified for the final of the 1908-09 Challenge Cup. On June 13, 1909, 
Vancouver was between a sport club 2-1 at the Ho Ward Stadium. Vancouver was won the 1908-09 and 1909-10 seasons of the Hungarian League. 1910s. The 1910-11, 1911-12, 1911-12, and 1912-13 seasons of the Hungarian League were won by Funkler Roz. In the 1911 December season, Funkler Roz beat 3. Kira won quarter Lichi TV 11 a Euro 3. I'm Schlosser scored 8 goals, which is still a club record for a single match. On February 12, 1911, the club's current stadium was inaugurated. The first goal in the new stadium was scored by Im Schlosser. In 1911 December Funkler Ross went on a European tour. On December 24, 1911, the first match was won by Funkler Ross 5-3 against Victoria Hamburg in Hamburg, Kingdom of Prussia. On December 25, 1911, Funkler Ross beat Bremen SC 5-0 and on December 30, 1911 Funkler Ross beat Hertha BSC 4-2 in Berlin. Kingdom of Prussia. On January 1, 1912, Funkler Ross beat BFC Prussen 7 2 in Berlin. On January 8, 1912, won for the first time in England by beating Woking FC 3 2 in London, the United Kingdom. On January 10, 1929, Funkler Ross lost their last match 4 1 against English Wanderers in London, the United Kingdom. In 1914 the First World War broke out which affected Van Clarus since many of the club's players were enlisted and many of them have never returned. The Hungarian Football Federation did not organize any competitions between the 1913-14 and the 1916-17 seasons. 1920s The 1920s did not start good for Van Clarus since their MTK Budapest FC won five consecutive Hungarian league titles. Furthermore, in the 1924 Euro 25 season, Finkler was lost 14 Euro 2 to MTK Hungary FC, which has been the biggest defeat in the Hungarian league. However, in 1926, Finkler was became Hungarian champion again after 13 years. Finkler was won the 1926-27 and the 1927-28 seasons of the Hungarian league. Funkler was entered the Mitropa Cup 1928 and won the first tie against BSK Biograd 7 0 and Biograd, Yugoslavia on August 19. The return match was won by Funkler was 6 1 on August 26. In the semi finals, Funkler was beat SK Admiral Wien 2 1 at the Ho Ward Stadium on September 9, 1928. The second tie was also won by Funkler was 1 0 at the OLRIT Stadium. In the final Finkler was beat SK Rapid win 7-1 at the OLRIT Stadium on October 28, 1928. The return match was won by SK Rapid win by 5-3 on November 11, 1928. Finkler was participated in a South American tour in Brazil, Uruguay, and Argentina playing in four different cities, Zar Pound do Paulo, Rio de Janeiro, Montevideo and Buenos Aires. On June 30, 1929, Funkler was beat Zar Pound Paulo 2 1 in Zar Pound Paulo, Brazil. On July 4, 1929, Funkler drew with Fluminense FC in the Rio de Janeiro 3 3 in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. On July 11, 1929, Funkler lost to Brazil in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. On July 14, 1929, Funkler was lost to Palestra Italia Futebol Club 5-2 and on July 21, 1929 Funkler was beat Uruguay in Montevideo, Uruguay. On July 25, 1929, Funkler was beat 4-1 Montevideo in Montevideo, and lost to Uruguay 3-0. The next series of matches were played in Argentina, where Funkler was beat River Plate FC. 4-3 in Buenos Aires on August 1, 1929. On August 3, 1929, Funkler Ross flew back to Montevideo where they lost to Pinaral at La Copyright Tico Club 2-0. On August 5, 1929, Funkler Ross played in Buenos Aires against Racing Club de Avellaneda and won 2-1. On August 10, 1929, Funkler Ross lost 2-0 to Argentina in Buenos Aires. On August 13, 1929, 
Funke was repeatedly beat racing 2-1 in Buenos Aires. The last match was played on August 17, 1929 against Zar Pando Paulo. Funke was lost to 2-1 in Zar Pando Paulo, Brazil. Funke was entered the Mitropa Cup 1930 and drew with SK Slavia Prague in Prague, Czechoslovakia. The home match was won by Funke was by 1-0 in the quarter-finals. In the semi-finals Funke was lost the away match 5-0 against SK Rapid Wien. The home match was won by 1-0 by Funke was but SK Rapid Wien qualified for the finals on 5-1 aggregate. 1930s in the 1930s Funke was won the Hungarian League four times in 1932, 1934, 1938, and 1940. In the 1931 a Euro 32 season of the Hungarian League, Funke was won all 22 matches, which is still a record in the Hungarian League and during the season the team scored their 400th goal in the championship. Funke was entered the Mitropa Cup 1932 season and lost 4-0 to Juventus FC. In Turin, Italy. The home match was a 3-3 draw which resulted the elimination of the club from the Mitropa Cup 1932. According to the French magazine, Lotto, Funke was, was the seventh best team in Europe in 1933. Funke was played in the Mitropa Cup 1934 season. In the first round Funke was beat Florets for AC 8-0 at home and 2-1 away. In the quarter-finals Funke was beat SK Kladno 6-0 at home and lost to 4-1 away. In the semi-finals Funke was drew with AC Bologna and lost the away match 5-1 which resulted the farewell for the club from the Mitropa Cup 1934. Funke was participated in the Mitropa Cup 1935 season. Funke Ros played their first match of the season against AS Roma in Rome, Italy in the first round. The first leg of the tie was won by AS Roma by 3-1, but the second leg was won by Funke Ros 8-0. In the quarter-finals Funke Ros lost 4-2 to SK Angstrom 1 half Idenis and No, Czechoslovakia, but the second leg was won by Funke Ros 6-1. In the semi-finals Funke was beat FK Austria Wien 4-2 and lost the away match 3-2. In the final Funke was beat AC Sparta Prague 2-1 at home on September 8, but lost to 3-0 in Prague, Czechoslovakia. Funke was participated in the Mitropa Cup 1936 season. Funke was entered the first round and won the first tie 5-2 against SK Slavia Prague, but the away match was lost to 4-0. Therefore, Funke Ros was eliminated from the Mitropa Cup 1936. In 1937 Funke Ros participated in the Mitropa Cup. In the first round Funke Ros played in Prague, Czechoslovakia and drew with SK Slavia Prague. At home Funke Ros beat SK Slavia Prague 3-1 and qualified for the next round. In the quarter-finals Funke Ros hosted first Vienna FC and beat them 2-1 while the away match was lost to 1-0. The tie was decided on a playoff which was won by Funke Ros 2-1. In the semi-finals Funke Ros lost to FK Austria Wien 4-1 in Wien, Austria while won the home match was won by Funke Ros 6-1 and qualified for the finals. In the final of the Mitrop Cup 1937, Funke Ros beat SS Lazio 4-2 at home on September 12 and 5-4 in Rome, Italy on October 24, 1940s. In the 1940s, Funke Ros celebrated two Hungarian league titles in 1941 and in 1949. In the 1940 Euro 41 season the team scored more than 100 goals. In the 1940s, Funke Ros were the first team to fly to the United States. On October 31, 1948, Funke Ros played their 1,000th match in the Hungarian National Championship I. In the 1948 Euro 49 season, the team celebrated their 50th anniversary with a gold medal. During the season the team scored 140 goals in 30 matches. The team won the Hungarian Cup three times in 1942, 1943, and 1944. 1950s the 1950s was dominated by Budapest on the copyright DFC and Funke Ros failed to win any Hungarian league titles. However, 
von Quaros won the Hungarian Cup title in 1958. In 1951, the team changed their name to Kinaitsai, 1960s. In the 1960s von Quaros won the Hungarian League four times. Von Quaros played in three European finals, the Intercities Fairs Cup 1964-65 against Juventus FC, the Intercities Fairs Cup 1967-68 against Leeds United AFC and the UEFA Cup Winners Cup 1974-75 against Dynamo Kiev. Although Funkvaros only won the Intercities Fairs Cup 1964-65, they are the only Hungarian team to win a European trophy. Funkvaros entered the first season of the UEFA Cup Winners Cup, the UEFA Cup Winners Cup 1960-61. In the first round from Quiroz lost 4-2 to Rangers FC. In Glasgow, Scotland on August 1, 1960. The second round was won by from Quiroz 2-1 at home on August 11, 1960. From Quiroz entered the Intercities Fairs Cup 1962 a Euro 63 season. In the first round from Quiroz lost 4-3 the first leg to Victoria Car Paragraph LN, in Car Paragraph LN, Germany while the second leg was won by Funkvaros 4-1. In the second round, on December 1, 1962 Funkvaros lost 1-0 to UC Sampdoria in Genoa, Italy. On December 12, 1962 Funkvaros beat UC Sampdoria 6-0 at home. In the quarter-finals Funkvaros beat FC Patrol Ploie unregistered trademark T2-0 at home while lost the away match 1-0 and Ploie unregistered trademark T, Romania. In the semi-finals, Funkvaros lost to NK Dinamo Zagreb 1-0 at home and Funkvaros lost the away match 2-1 in Zagreb, Yugoslavia. Funkvaros won the 1962-63 season of the Hungarian League. Therefore, Funkvaros entered the European Cup 1963-64 season. On September 11, 1963, Funkvaros lost to Galatasaray SK. 4-0 at the BJK A Degree Na Paragraph Na One Quarter Stadium in Istanbul, Turkey. On October 12, 1963, the second leg was won by Funkvaros 2-0 but the Turkish club qualified for the next round on 4-2 aggregate. Funkvaros won the 1964 season of the Hungarian League. Funkvaros entered the Intercities Fairs Cup 1964-65. Funkvaros beat Spartak No. 2 a Euro 0 at home and lost 1-0 away. In the second round Funkvaros lost 1-0 to Wiener Sport Club in Wien, Austria, but won their home match 2-1. In the playoff match Funkvaros won 2-0 in Budapest and qualified for the next round. In the third round Funkvaros beat AS Roma 2-1 at the Stadio Olimpico, Rome, Italy. The home match was also won by Funkvaros by beating AS Roma 1-0. In the quarter-finals Funkvaros beat Athletic Bilbao 1-0 at home. However, Funkvaros lost 2-1 to Athletic Bilbao in Bilbao, Spain. The playoff match was won by Funkvaros 3-0 in Budapest. In the semi-ifnals Funkvaros lost 3-2 to Manchester United FC. At the Old Trafford Stadium, Manchester, England. The home match was won by Funkvaros 1-0. The playoff match was also won by Funkvaros by 2-1 in Budapest. The 1965 Intercities Fairs Cup final was played on June 23, 1965 in Turin at the Stadio Comunal di Torino in front of the home crowd of Juventus FC. 40,000 spectators. The only goal of the match was scored in the 74th minute by Marta copyright Fenovsi and Funkvaros won the Intercities Fairs Cup. Funkvaros entered 1965 a Euro 66 European Cup. In the preliminary round, Funkvaros beat Kaflovike Football Club 4-1 in Rekjavike, Iceland on August 29, 1965. The second leg was won by Funkvaros 9-1 at the NAR Copyright Stadium on September 8, 1965. In the first round, Funkvaros drew with Panathinaikos FC. At the NAR Copyright Stadium on November 10, 1965. 
The second leg was won by Fankvaros 3 Euro 1 at the Apostolos Nikolaidis Stadium in Thessaloniki, Greece on November 17, 1965. In the quarter-finals, on February 13, 1966 Fankvaros lost 4-0 to FC Internazionale at the Stadio Giuseppe Mezza, in Milan, Italy. The second leg was a 1-1 draw at the NAR Copyright Stadium on March 2, 1966. Fankvaros participated in the Intercities Fairs Cup 1966-67 season. Fankvaros drew with NK Olimpija Ljubljana in Ljubljana, Yugoslavia, while Fankvaros won their home match 3-0 in Budapest. In the second round Fankvaros drew with Ajia YTE is in Ajia YTE, Sweden, but Fankvaros could win their home match 7-1. In the third round Fankvaros lost 4-1 to Eintracht Frankfurt in Frankfurt, West Germany, but Fankvaros could win their home match 2-1 in Budapest. However, Fankvaros were eliminated from the Intercities Fairs Cup. Fankvaros won the 1967 season of the Hungarian League. Flaku Drea N. Albert was named European Footballer of the Year in 1967. He is the most successful Fankvaros since the formation of the club scoring 255 goals in 351 matches from 1958 to Euro 74. In the Intercities Fairs Cup 1967-68, Fankvaros lost 3-1 to FC Arj Pishieti in Petit Unregistered Trademark T, Romania. However, Fankvaros won their home match by 4-0 and advanced to the next round. In the second round Fankvaros lost 2-1 to Real Zaragoza in Zaragoza. Spain. At home Vancouveros won the tie 3-0. In the third round Vancouveros beat Liverpool FC. 1-0 at home. At the Anfield, Liverpool, England, Vancouveros also beat Liverpool FC. 1-0. In the quarter-finals Vancouveros beat Athletic Bilbao 2-1 at home, and Vancouveros also could win 2-1 away and qualified for the next round on 4-2 aggregate. In the semi-finals Vancouveros beat Bologna FC. 1909 3-2 at home and drew in Bologna, Italy. In the first leg of the final, Vancouveros lost 1-0 to Leeds United AFC. At Elland Road, and drew 0-0 in the second match at the NAR Copyright Stadium in front of 76,000 spectators, which meant that Vancouveros failed to claim their second Intercities Fairs Cup title. Fankvaros won the 1968 season of the Hungarian League. Therefore, Fankvaros could have entered the European Cup 1968-69 season, but the club withdrew in protest to a redraw by UEFA of the first round keeping clubs from Eastern Europe and Western Europe separate, after Western countries had threatened a boycott due to the Soviet invasion of Czechoslovakia. Fankvaros entered the European Cup 1969-70 season. In the first round Fankvaros lost 2-1 to CSKA Sofia in Sofia, Bulgaria on September 17, 1969. The home match was won by Fankvaros 4-1 on October 1, 1969. In the second round Fankvaros lost 3-0 to Leeds United AFC. At Elland Road in Leeds, England on November 12, 1969. At home Vancouveros were also beaten 3-0 on November 26, 1969 which resulted the farewell of the club from the European Cup, 1970s. In the 1970s, Vancouveros won the Hungarian League only once, in 1976, but were more successful in the Hungarian Cup, which they won four times. Vancouveros entered the Intercities Fairs Cup 1970-71. In the first round, Vancouveros lost 1-0 to Liverpool FC. In Liverpool, England. At home Vancouveros drew with Liverpool which resulted their farewell from the Intercities Fairs Cup. Vancouveros participated in the first edition of the UEFA Cup, the 1971-72 UEFA Cup. In the first round, Vancouveros drew with Fina Bihar Section ESK. At the Angstrom a one-quarter Kra one-quarter Sarakoya Stadium, in Istanbul, Turkey on September 14, 1971. At home Vancouveros beat Fina Bihar Section ESK. 3-1 on September 29, 1971. In the second round, 
On October 20, 1971 Fonkvaros beat Paninio's NFC 6-0 at home. The return match was cancelled, scheduled November 4, 1971. In the third round, Fonkvaros drew with Eintracht Braunschweig in Braunschweig, West Germany on November 24, 1971. At home Vinkvaros won the return match by 5-2 on December 8, 1971. On March 9, 1972, Vinkvaros lost 2-1 to FK Angstrom 1 half Algezia Sarajevo at home. 3 Euro 3 on March 22, 1972, Vinkvaros won 2-1 in Sarajevo, Yugoslavia. On penalty shootout Vinkvaros won 5-4. In the semi-finals Vinkvaros drew with Wolverhampton Wanderers FC. At home, and lost 2-1 in Wolverhampton, England. Vinkvaros entered the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup 1972-73 season. In the first round, Vinkvaros lost Floriana FC. 0-1, in Malta. On the return match Vinkvaros won 6-0 and qualified for the next round. In the second round Vinkvaros beat Sparta Prague 2-0 at home, but Vinkvaros lost 4-1 on the return match and were eliminated from the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup. Vinkvaros entered the 1973-74 UEFA Cup. On September 19, 1973, Vinkvaros lost 1-0 to Gudia Warsaw at home. On October 3, 1973, Vinkvaros were beaten 2-1 in Warsaw, Poland. Vinkvaros participated in the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup 1974-75 season. In the first round, Vinkvaros beat Cardiff City FC. 2-0 at home. The return match was won by Vinkvaros 4-1 in Cardiff, Wales. In the second round, Vinkvaros drew with Liverpool FC. At the Anfield, in Liverpool, England. On the return match. The result was a goalless draw which resulted the qualification of Vinkvaros for the next round. In the quarter-finals, Vinkvaros beat Malmö Paragraph FF3-1 in Malmö Paragraph, Sweden. On the return match, Vinkvaros drew with Malmö Paragraph. In the semi-finals, Vinkvaros beat Red Star Belgrade 2-1 at home. On the return match Vinkvaros drew with Red Star Belgrade in Belgrade, Yugoslavia. In the final Vinkvaros lost 3-0 to FC Dynamo Kiev. Vinkvaros won the 1975-76 season of the Hungarian League. Therefore, Vinkvaros could enter the European Cup 1976-77. Vinkvaros beat June Sash 5-1 at home on September 15, 1976. On September 29, 1976, Vinkvaros also won the return match by 6-2. In the second round, Vinkvaros beat Dynamo Dresden 1-0 at home on October 20, 1976. However, on November 3, 1976, Vinkvaros were beaten by Dresden 4-0 in Dresden, East Germany which resulted the farewell for the club. Vinkvaros entered the 1977-78 UEFA Cup. On September 17, 1977, Vinkvaros were beaten 3-0 by Merk Dupnitsa at the Bontjuk Stadium in Dupnitsa, Bulgaria. On the return match, on September 28, 1977, Vinkvaros won 2-0 but failed to qualify for the next round. Vinkvaros entered the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup 1978-79 season. In the first round Vinkvaros beat Kalmar FF 2-0 at home. On the return match, Vinkvaros drew with Kalmar and qualified for the next round. In the second round, Vinkvaros lost the first leg of the tie against 1. FC Magdeburg by 1-0 in Magdeburg, East Germany. At home, Vinkvaros won 2-1 but the East German team won on away goals. Vinkvaros participated in the 1979-80 UEFA Cup. On September 18, 1979, Vinkvaros were beaten 3-0 by Lokomotiv Sofia at the Lokomotiv Stadium, in Sofia, Bulgaria. On October 3, 1979, Vinkvaros won 2-0 but they were unable to qualify for the next round. On March 17, 1974, 
the legendary and iconic flower cubed rear N. Albert played his last match and said adieu with a goal. 1980s Von Kvaros won the 1980-81 season of the Hungarian League. As a consequence, Von Kvaros entered the European Cup 1981-82 season. In the first round Von Kvaros beat Barnake Ostrava 3-2 at home on September 16, 1981. However, Frank Veroz lost 3-0 in Basali Stadium in Ostrava, Czechoslovakia on September 30, 1981. Funk Veroz entered the 1982-83 UEFA Cup. In the first round, Funk Veroz beat Athletic Bilbao 2-1 at home. On the return match Funk Veroz drew with Athletic Bilbao in Bilbao, Spain. In the second round, Funk Veroz drew with FC Zar 1 Quarterich at home. On the return match, Funk Veroz lost to 1-0 and Zar 1 Quarterich, Switzerland and they were eliminated from the UEFA Cup. Funk Veroz participated in the 1983-84 UEFA Cup. On September 14, Funk Veroz lost 4-2 to PSV Eindhoven in Eindhoven, Netherlands. On September 28, 1983, Von Kvaros were beaten 2-0 at home by PSV Eindhoven and were eliminated from the UEFA Cup. Von Kvaros entered the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup 1989-90 season. In the first round, Von Kvaros beat FC Harker 5-1 at home. On the return match, the final result was a 1-1 draw. In the second round, Von Kvaros lost 1-0 to VFB Admiral Wacker Mar Paragraf Dling in Mar Paragraf Dling, Austria. At home Von Kvaros were also beaten by Admiral Wacker 1-0. Tyburn Yailasi was awarded the Silver Shoes by scoring 30 goals in one season. 1990s In the 1990s Von Kvaros won the Hungarian League three times, in 1992, 1995, and 1996. As far as the Hungarian Cup is concerned, Von Kvaros won four titles in 1991, 1993, 1994, 1995. Von Kvaros entered the 1990-91 UEFA Cup season. Von Kvaros won the 1990-91 season of the Hungarian Cup. Therefore, Von Kvaros entered the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup 1991-92 season. In the first round, Von Kvaros beat Levski Sofia 3-2 in Sofia, Bulgaria. At home Von Kvaros beat 4-1 Levski Sofia ABND qualified for the next round. In the second round, Von Kvaros lost 3-2 to Werder Bremen, in Bremen, Germany. At home, Von Kvaros lost 1-0 and they were eliminated from the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup. Von Kvaros won the 1992-93 season of the Hungarian Cup. Consequently, Von Kvaros were eligible for entering the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup 1993-94. In the first round, Von Kvaros were beaten 3-0 by FC Wacker Innsbruck in Innsbruck, Austria. On the return match Wacker Innsbruck beat Von Kvaros 2-1 in Budapest. Von Kvaros won the 1993-94 season of the Hungarian Cup. Therefore, Von Kvaros could enter the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup 1994-95 season. In the preliminary round, Von Kvaros beat F91 Dudla Lang 6-1 at home. On the return match, Von Kvaros could also score six goals and won the match by 6-1 in Dudla Lang, Luxembourg. In the first round, Von Kvaros lost 2-1 to CSKA Moscow in Moscow, Russia. At home, Von Kvaros beat CSKA Moscow 2-1 and won the penalty shootout by 7-6. In the second round, Von Kvaros lost 6-0 to FC Porto in Porto, Portugal. However, the return match was won by Von Kvaros 2-0 at home. Von Kvaros won the 1994-95 season of the Hungarian League. Therefore, Von Kvaros were eligible for entering the UEFA Champions League 1995-96 season. On August 9, 1995, Von Kvaros beat RSC Anderlecht 1-0 in Brussels, Belgium in the qualifying round on August 9, 1995. On the return match, 
from Quiroz True with Anderlecht on August 23, 1995 which resulted the qualification for the group stage of the 1995. On September 13, 1995, Von Quiroz beat Grasshopper Club Zar 1 quarter rich 3 0 and Stadion Hard Tuum, in Zar 1 quarter rich, Switzerland. On the second match day, Von Quiroz were beaten by Ajax Amsterdam 5 1 at home. On October 18, 1995, Von Quiroz were beaten 6 1 at the Santiago Bernabe Copyright U Stadium by Real Madrid Compare on November 1, 1995, Von Quiroz drew with Real Madrid Compare at home. On the fifth match day, Von Quiroz drew with Grasshopper Club Zar 1 quarter rich at home. On the last match day, Von Quiroz were beaten 4 0 at the Olympisch Stadion by Ajax Amsterdam, in Amsterdam, Netherlands. Von Quiroz won the 1995 96 season of the Hungarian League. As a consequence, Von Quiroz entered the UEFA Champions League 1996 97 season. On August 7, 1996, von Quiroz lost 3-0 to IFK Gar Paragraph to Borg in Gar Paragraph to Borg, Sweden. On August 21, 1996, von Quiroz drew with Gar Paragraph to Borg and they were eliminated from the UEFA Champions League. Von Quiroz entered the 1996-97 UEFA Cup. Von Quiroz beat Olimiakos FC. 3-1 at home in the first round on September 10, 1996 Von Quiroz beat Olimiakos 3-0 and Piraeus, Greece on September 24, 1996. On October 15, 1996, Von Quiroz beat Newcastle United FC. 3-2 at home, but on the return match Newcastle beat Von Quiroz 4-0 at the St. James Park on October 29, 1996. Von Quiroz entered the 1997-98 UEFA Cup. In the first qualifying round, Von Quiroz beat Bohemian FC. 1-0 in Dublin, Ireland. On the return match, Von Quiroz won 5-0 on July 29, 1997. In the second qualifying round, Von Quiroz beat Helsingborg's IF 1-0 in Helsingborg, Sweden on August 12, 1997. On the return match Von Quiroz lost 1-0 to Helsingborg, but won on penalty shootout 4-3. In the first round, Von Quiroz lost 3-0 to OFI Crete in Heraklion, Greece. On the return match, Von Quiroz won 2-1 but they were unable to qualify for the next round. Von Quiroz participated in the 1998-99 UEFA Cup. Von Quiroz beat CE Principat 6-0 at home on July 22, 1998. On the return match, Von Quiroz won 8-1 at the DEVK Arena in Andorra La Vella, Andorra. In the second qualifying round, Von Quiroz beat AEK Athens FC. 4-2 at home. However, on August 25, 1998 Von Quiroz were beaten 4-0 in Athens, Greece. Von Quiroz entered the 1999-2000 UEFA Cup. In the qualifying round, Von Quiroz beat FC Tiraspol 3-1 at home. On August 26, 1999, Von Quiroz drew with Tiraspol and Chai unregistered trademark Ina Flora New, Moldavia. In the first round, Von Quiroz lost 3-1 to FK Tiraspol in Tiraspol, Czech Republic. On the return match, Von Quiroz drew with Tiraspol at home on September 30, 1999. 2000s. Xanglied Von Quiroz won the 2000 January season of the Hungarian League. As a consequence, Von Quiroz were eligible for entering the 2001 02 UEFA Champions League. On July 25, 2001, Von Quiroz drew with Hajduk Split at home. On August 1, 2001, Von Quiroz drew with Hajduk Split at the Stadion Pol Jude in Split, Croatia. Von Quiroz lost on penalty shootout and they were eliminated from the UEFA Champions League. In 2003, Von Quiroz were listed on the Budapest Stock Exchange, the first Hungarian club to become a public limited company. Pinter copywriter Led Von Quiroz won the 2002-03. Therefore, Von Quiroz could enter the 2004-05 UEFA Champions League season. 
On July 27, 2004, Vankvaras beat KF Tirana 3-2 in Tirana, Albania. On the return match, on August 4, 2004, Vankvaras lost 1-0 to Tirana, but qualified for the next round on away goals rule. In the third qualifying round Vankvaras beat Sparta Prague 1-0 at home on August 11, 2004. On August 25, 2004, Vankvaras lost 1-0 at the Stadion Letna, Prague, Czech Republic. After extra time Sparta Prague scored one goal and eliminated Vankvaras from the UEFA Champions League. However, Vankvaras were eligible for entering the first round of the 2004-05 UEFA Cup. On September 16, 2004, Vankvaras drew with Millwall FC. At the Den, South Bermondsey, London. On September 30, 2004, Vankvaras beat Millwall 3-1 at home and qualified for the 2004-05 UEFA Cup group stage. On November 4, 2004, Vankvaras drew with Feyenoord Rotterdam at home. On November 25, 2004, Vankvaras lost 2-0 to FC Schalke 4 at the Veltins Arena, Gelsenkirchen, Germany. On December 1, 2004, Vankvaras lost 2-1 to FC Basel at home. On December 15, 2004, Vankvaras defeated Hearts of Midlothian 1-0-0 a Euro Zero at the Tynexel Stadium, Edinburgh, Scotland. On November 16, 2004, Vankvaras launched a wide-ranging anti-racism campaign in order to eliminate intolerance and discrimination in football. Four club players including half-Nigerian half-Hungarian Sauenmi and half-Brazilian half-Hungarian Lendro, Leap Gzu, Ranking Cubed Czar and Head Coach, Gzabalaya ZLA Cubed, featured on a campaign poster carrying the slogan Silence Racism. The club asked their supporters to show the poster in the second minute of the 2004-05 UEFA Cup group stage match against Feyenoord Rotterdam on November 4, 2004. After the match, Feyenoord coach Gullit said, it was a great idea by Vankvaros. In the 2004 Euro 05 season of the Hungarian League, Vankvaros finished second and therefore qualified for the 2005-06 UEFA Cup. On July 14, 2005, Vankvaros lost 0-2 to FC Partizan Minsk at home. On July 28, 2005, Vankvaros beat Partizan Minsk 2-1 in Minsk, Belarusia but Vankvaros were eliminated from the UEFA Cup. In the 2005 June season Vankvaros finished sixth in the Hungarian League. However, in July 2006, the club was relegated from the Hungarian League and Vankvaros were relegated to the Hungarian League too as punishment for continued financial difficulties. The club challenged the legality of this move in court. Vankvaras won the case as the verdict declared that the move of the Hungarian Football Federation was against the law. An out-of-court agreement between the club and the Hungarian Football Federation was reached. In the season 2006 July of the Hungarian League 2, Nayar Raji Horzar beat Vankvaras to promotion in a tight contest, ensuring that Vankvaras stayed in the second division. Despite investments in players, including former Vankvaras stars, the season 2007 August brought further trouble. This time Kekskima Copyright and Solnok both outran Vankvaras in the Eastern Group of the Hungarian League 2 title race. In 2009 Craig Short was nominated as the new manager of the club. In the 2008 September season, however, Vankvaras finally secured its return to the Hungarian League on May 22, 2009. 2010s in the 2010 Euro 11 season of the Hungarian League, Vankvaras finished third. As a consequence, Vankvaras entered the 2011 Euro 12 UEFA Europa League season. On June 30, 2011, Vankvaras beat Ulysses 3-0 at home in the first qualifying round. On July 7, 2011, Vankvaras beat Ulysses 2-0 at the Hasdan Stadium, Yerevan, Armenia. On July 14, Vankvaras beat Arl Sons FK 2-1 at home. On July 21, 2011, Vankvaras lost 2-1 to Arl Sons in Alessand, Norway. Arl Sons won 3-1 after extra time and eliminated Vankvaras from the UEFA Europa League.
On October 31, 2011, club legend Fla Cube Rear N. Albert died at the age of 70 after complications following heart surgery. On February 25, 2014, Funkvara's chief executive officer Pa Lero signed an agreement with chief executive David McNally of the Premier League club, Norwich City FC. The link up is expected to start immediately and will provide footballing and commercial opportunities for both Funkvara and Norwich in the near future. Naming history, 1899-1951, Funkvarosi Tourner Club, 1951-1956, Kinaitsai, 1956 a Euro present, Funkvarosi Tourner Club, Stadium. The home stadium of Funkvaros is Stadium Albert Flakubria N which is located in Funkvaros, Budapest. The stadium has a capacity of 18,100, set to be expanded to 25,000. Formerly known as T Stadium for its location, it has been renamed for Ballon d'Or winner club legend Flacubria N. Albert Esser in 2007. The first stadium was started to be built in the autumn of 1910. On February 12, 1911, Funkvaros played their first match against Budapest rival MTK Budapest which was won by the club. The starting lineup consisted of Fritz, Rumbold, Munlitz, Weinberg, Bra Cube DY, Pear, Seitler, Wise, Cora Cube DY, Schlosser, Borba S. The first stadium could host 40,000 spectators. In 1971, the stands were demolished and a new stadium was started to be built. The new stadium was inaugurated on the 75th anniversary of the club. On May 19, 1974, the first match was played against the Vases Old Boys. The new stadium could host 29,505 spectators. In the 1990s the stadium was redesigned to meet the UEFA requirements therefore its capacity was reduced to 18,100. On December 21, 2007, the stadium was changed from Aralaria T Stadium to Stadium Albert Fla Cubed Rio N. Fla Cubed Rio N. Albert, the former Fankvaros icon, was present at the inauguration ceremony. Sheffield United FC chairman Kevin McCabe's Hungarian firm Esplanade KFT have agreed to buy Funkvaroz's real estate, including their stadium, for a £8.45 million. He planned to redevelop the area and upgrade the stadium to meet FIFA and UEFA requirements. 1. In 2012 Garbok Hibitov, the chairman of the club, announced that a new stadium is going to be built on the same location. On March 28, 2013 the demolition of the old Albert Stadium has started. The construction of the new Funkvaros Arena is executed by market at Permel Parteri Peri ZRT and expected to be finished at around August 2014. The new stadium will be the most modern stadium in Central Europe with 24.000 seats and a free-to-use Wi-Fi system that the supporters can use to place their orders at the bars of the stadium. Through the stadium's own mobile application it will be available to follow the match real-time on the mobile devices and to replay the most interesting moments of the events. Beside hosting the football club's home matches, the Hungarian national side will place some of its encounters in this stadium and also concerts will be held here. The arena has the function of an event center too. Ownership On February 14, 2008, Sheffield United Public Limited Company Chairman Kevin McCabe, successfully acquired a tender to purchase Funkvaroz. McCabe's Hungarian company, Esplanade Limited Liability Company bought Funkvaroz real estate for a £8.45 million with a view to start paying off the A5 million currency debts. In April 2008, Funkvaroz Tourner Club officially agreed to sell the football club, Funkvaroz Labdera Gar Cube ZRT to Esplanade KFT. McCabe's company in Hungary. In 2011, McCabe relinquished his ownership of the club after describing a strained relationship with some minority shareholders. On February 25, 2011, Garbok Hibitov, Hungarian MP, was appointed as the president of Finkvaroz. Club sponsors, main diamond sponsor, Drew Palmer Garancia Insurance, diamond ranked sponsors, Beva Rossi Xatornazar Cmar Plus or Minus Beck, Senk Sejatar Copyright KZRT. Exclusive Partners, Provident, Budapest Gasworks Company. Seat, 
marketer Pamel Partey Perry ZRT. Equipment supplier, Nike, Freddy Business Club members, Dover, BTEL, August Confectionery, Endo Service, Raditech, Hungest Hotel, San Benedetto, GDF Suez, a Euro Nomadum Fella Euro Unregistered Trademark Foundation, Rivalry. Funkvaras are in rivalry with several teams from Budapest including MTK Budapest, Ashpist, Budapest on the copyright D and several provincial clubs such as Debrecen and Diakubz Gyre. Since Funkvaras have been the most successful club of the Hungarian football history by winning 28 Hungarian league titles and 20 Hungarian cup titles and the most successful Hungarian club in the European football competitions by winning the Intercities Fairs Cup 1964-65 season every club in the Hungarian league wants to defeat them. The rivalry with MTK Budapest dates back to as early as 1903 when Funkvaras first won the Hungarian league. In the following three decades either Funkvaras or MTK Budapest won the domestic league. The rivalry with Ashpist dates back to 1930s when Ashpist won their first Hungarian league title. Since then the fixture between the two teams attracts the most spectators in the Domtistic league. The matches between the two teams often ends in violence which causes big trouble for the Hungarian football. The proposal of personal registration was refused by both clubs. Supporters, supporters of Funkvaras are mainly from the capital city of Hungary, Budapest. However, the club is popular all over Hungary. The supporters of Funkvaras are considered as the most violent in Hungary. On November 26, 2002, the UEFA Control and Disciplinary Committee fined Funkvaras 18,300 for fireworks and hooliganism related offences committed by the fans of Funkvaras before and after the 2002 03 UEFA Cup second tie against VFB Stuttgart on November 12, 2002. In 2004, Funkvaras were charged by UEFA with crowd trouble and racist abuse after playing Millwall FC. In the 2004-05 UEFA Cup tie in Budapest, Hungary, four fans of Millwall suffered stab wounds. The racist abuse was directed at Millwall's players of African origin, Ephil. On July 17, 2013, Funkvaras fans fought with police after a friendly match against Leeds United AFC, which ended with a 1-0 victory over the championship club, in Mirska Sabota, Slovenia. Famous supporters. Fekka Cubed Bala ZS, Sold Baumgartner, Gula DK Bill, Gyal Paragraph R G Y D R Paragraph R N E R, Karolia Purges, Elian Gar One Quarter N T H E R, Tom S. Hevesy, Jar Nose Car Cubed Bon, Istvan N. Corvus S, Jar Nose Co Cubed S, Par Copyright to La Copyright Car Cubed, Par Copyright to Marta Copyright, Fira Cubed Negi, Gula Autute, Barbara Palvin, Attila Pataki, Istvo and Tala Cubed S, Istvo and Bar Paragraph R Paragraph S, Players, First Team Squad, Updated January 7, 2014. Note, flags indicate national team as defined under FIFA eligibility rules. Players may hold more than one non-FIFA nationality. Retired Numbers, 2, Tiber Simon, Defender, Posthumous Honor. 12 a Euro the 12th man, reserved for club supporters. Number retired in 2007. On loan, note, flags indicate national team as defined under FIFA eligibility rules. Players may hold more than one non-FIFA nationality. Notable former players, had senior international cap, S, for their respective countries. Players whose name is listed in bold represented their countries while playing for Funke Notes, non-playing staff, coaches, former presidents, honours, Hungarian League, winners 1, 1903, 1905, 1907, 1909, 1910, 1911, 1912, 1913, 1926, 1927, 1928, 1932, 1934, 1938, 1940, 1941, 1949, 1963, 1964, 1967, 1968, 1976, 1981, 1992, 1995, 1996, 2001, 
2004. Hungarian Cup, Winners 2, 1913, 1922, 1927, 1928, 1933, 1935, 1942, 1943, 1944, 1958, 1972, 1974, 1976, 1978, 1991, 1993, 1994, 1995, 2003, 2004. Hungarian League Cup, winners, 2013. Hungarian Super Cup, winners, 1993, 1994, 1995, 2004. Intercities Bears Cup, winners, 1965, runners up, 1968. Mitropa Cup, winners, 1928, 1937, runners up, 1935, 1938, 1939, 1940. European Cup Winners' Cup, runners up, 1975. Football Impact Cup, winner, 2013. Challenge Cup, winner, 1909, runners up, 1902, 1911. Notes Note 1, more than any other Hungarian football club. Note 2, more than any other Hungarian football club. Season results, notes. Note 1, Van Kvaros won the Western Group of the 1945-46 season by having played 26 matches gaining 45 points and was promoted to the best 10 teams where it finished 5th. Note 2, Van Kvaros won the Group B of the 1970 spring season and lost to 4-3 on aggregate against Ashpist. Note 3, 2 points deducted. Note 4, Van Kvaros did not receive license from the Hungarian Football Federation governed by Istvan Kustelki, therefore the club was relegated to the Hungarian League 2. Note 5, Kzaba Mata copyright as interim coach for two Hungarian League matches and one Hungarian Cup match. Other notes, italics equals competition in progress, NCH equals no competition held, GS equals group stage, R16 equals round of 16. R32 equals round of 32, Van Kvaros in European competition, notes. Note 1, playoff 2 a Euro 0. Note 2, playoff 3 a Euro 0. Note 3, playoff 2 a Euro 1, record by country of opposition, correct as of July 25, 2014, PA Euro played. WA Euro 1. DA Euro drawn. LA Euro lost, European records. Highest stage reached in UEFA European Cup UEFA Champions League, quarter-finals, biggest European home win, Van Kvaros 9-1 Kaflovake Football Club, biggest European away win, CE Principat 1-8 Van Kvaros, managers, statistics, most appearances, top scorers, notes. Note 1, co-top scorer of the Hungarian League. Note 2, also played for Stagler FC. Note 3, in the Hungarian League 2. Record departures, record arrivals, references. External links, official website, Van Kvaros Ultras, photos and videos, fans of Van Kvaros a Euro video blog, Ultra Group site, Van Kvaros Statistics site, XFTC Support Group Association, Soxaway Profile.